Hello everybody, what's up? <coughs> Sorry, <laughs> my name is Jeffcat45. Here and today we're going to be doing a review of the uh, Game Boy Pocket. So the Game Boy Pocket is essentially just a smaller Game Boy. And that's kind of it. Every th There's really only a few things that are majorly different with it other than the fact that it's a ton smaller. Um, so yeah. So, just like the Game Boy, you got your screen, I believe it's the the same size. You got your A, you got your B, you got your start and select, and you got your D-pad. This one's in this, like, cool blue color, so the Game Boy Pockets came in uh, a lot more different colors, a lot different uh, colors than the original Game Boy came in, because that came in, like, what, gray, green, black, and red, I think? But obviously, you know, the gray ones are the most common. And have fun trying to find the other ones. So, yeah. On the side here, we do have a the uh, contrast wheel. So that's still there. Sorry, I don't know. Everything seems to be out of focus. Not very well lit, but, you know. Um, so, yeah, there's your contrast wheel there. And then on the back, you have... Um, this is where your cartridge goes. So we just have Tetris... Um, that we're going to be de demonstrating. Um, yeah, you know, just your code and whatever. Uh, here's one of the downgrades for the smaller size. <clears throat> Instead of having four double A's, we have two triple A's. So battery life has gone down quite a bit, but it's still not terrible. I don't know what the battery life is on this. And also, when I did my Game Boy review, I believe I... Yeah, I like underestimated how much battery could be uh, was on it. It could, I, someone told me it could be like thirty hours, which is what I was thinking. Or wait, was I thinking? I don't know. Anyways, the original game I can get about thirty hours out of it, and then this is uh, probably a lot less. Um, on this side, you have your volume, and then up here is the exit, but. This one is the same as the Game Boy Colors. So this isn't actually the original Game Boys. Uh, we've already moved on to the Game Boy Colors. Even though I'm pretty sure this was made before the Game Boy Color. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. So, I mean, there you go. So that's this is the first uh, console to ever use that, I guess. On the bottom, we do have a headphone jack, the AC adapter, or the charger, whatever you want to call it. Um doesn't come with one in the box, I don't think. But, uh, it, it is there. If you do have it, have it, and then you have rechargeable batteries as well. And the power switch up here. So, turning it on, you're going to notice not a lot different from the original Game Boy. Um, really, there's nothing different with it. As so for, instead of, um four shades of green it's not four shades of black so it's actually like you know a useful color <laughs> and not a random one um so yeah as you can see this is black and not green so that is one of the, i think that's one of the better things about it um and then actually the game boy uh the game boy light uh, i think has even like a little bit better of a screen like, it doesn't ghost as much because the screen is pretty bad at ghosting. Which basically just means there's, like, little shadows of what stuff you've already done and it doesn't look very pretty. Um, but yeah, I mean... Other than that, it's pretty much just the same old Game Boy, just a little bit less light. Or, uh, battery life. Not light, sorry. <laughs> um, a little bit less, um, battery life. However, um... It, as the name suggests, it fits. In, it actually fits in your pocket, unlike the original Game Boy. I have a few pairs of pants that actually the original will fit in, but I mean, it's still even if it does fit, it's like a giant brick in your pants, and it's not very fun. So this is definitely a very nice system, and if you're going to play original Game Boy games, this is probably the way to do it um, rather than the original Game Boy. Um, Unless you're really going for the battery life, then I guess. But if you're not super worried about it, um, that's probably the way to go. Or just bring, bring a lot of batteries with you. But like I said, the battery life on this isn't 
terrible. Um, you can get quite a few hours out of it still. It just won't be as many. So yeah, there you go. The uh, Game Boy Pocket Review. Not a bad system. I rather enjoy it. I also want to zoom kind of bad at Tetris here. No, that's not that. It's kind of weird playing it through uh, my phone uh, here, so. Oh, there we go, finally. But, uh, yeah. So, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. That was the Game Boy Pocket.